You may have many cards in your wallet, but this one lets you access the world. I'm Jill Horner. This is Comcast Newsmakers. With me is John Miller. He is the library manager for the Dauphin County Library System. Thanks so much for being with us. Thank you for having me. When we think about going to the library, I remember growing up, going to the library, working on a book report, checking out books, but many people utilize the library in a variety of different ways today. Talk to us about that changing role of the library system. I have to say that books are still very popular at the library. Last year we circulated over a million items, but the library is much more than that now. It's really a community space. People gather for programs. They use uh, meeting rooms as a gathering place to meet with friends or book clubs or even uh, homeschool groups come to meet with us as well. So many different purposes that for the library, but when we get that library card, we can access many, many different things. We can check out books, obviously. We can come and use the library for the purposes that you mentioned. But let's focus on some of the other things that you do today. The library has gone high tech. That's right. Um, going beyond the role of traditional books and things like that, we now ha offer downloadable audiobooks, so you can go right onto our website and access audiobooks to use on your media players or your iPod or whatever. Uh, we also offer ebooks from two sources. We have Overdrive and Freeding both offer downloadable ebooks, some of them uh, for Kindles and some for other readers like uh, Sony's and things like that. So those are some of the things that we can do with that library card. Uh, now let's talk about some of the other things uh, as well. We have access to different databases. Uh, talk to us about what they include. Well, there are databases uh, that are useful to students, things to help with their homework. You can research journal articles if you needed to. Um, there's also a uh, news bank, so if you just want to look up old news articles or information, you can do that as well. And same thing, we have access to things that will help you with genealogical research if you're looking up your family tree in history. So many different opportunities there, but you mentioned different groups coming in using meeting spaces, using the library for different purposes. Everyone from those interested in downloading an audiobook to researching their family history, but people are utilizing your internet access within the library system as well. Why is that an important component of what you have to offer? Well, not everybody has home internet access these days or computers. Um, there's still a gap, and we're there to fill that gap because anyone who lives in Dauphin County can come in, get a library card with us, and start accessing our computers and information right away. This is especially useful to students who need help with their homework or doing their homework and job seekers who are looking for and applying for jobs. And that's an important point because it's not just kids who are coming in and using these search tools. That's correct. It's, uh, you know, these things are here for adults as well. And everything from Wi-Fi to the E and audio books to you know, resume writing tools and things like that are available at the library. Who can get a library card? You just have to be a resident of Dolphin County and present some valid ID and we will enter you into our system and it costs no cost to get your library card. Now, for those interested, uh, you actually have a, a library system. You have branches throughout the county. That's correct. There are eight library branches throughout the county as part of the Dolphin County Library System, and you can take out books from any of those branches and check them back into any of the other branches, and the books will shuffle around so you can order a book from one branch and have it delivered to another. And we just have a short time left, but we've mentioned all of the different services, but you also have a wide variety of programming. That's what we do, especially children's programming. We've worked in the last year to increase the number of programs that we're offering, and we have uh, great registration for them and great attendance. Thanks so much for being with us. Thank you for having me. We've been talking with John Miller of the Dolphin County Library System. I'm Jill Horner.